Alright guys, how's it going? Uh, this lesson is for people who want to uh, improve their picking speed, like literally like watch the bear picking. You know, not legato, hammer on to pull offs, fretting picking speed. Okay, I'm going to show you uh, three exercises, uh, and the first one is going to be uh, what I just played. So I'll show you that again. Okay, uh, to play that, um, you're going to start with an up stroke because generally, if you uh, go from higher to lower, uh, you, you start with an up stroke, like a lick that goes higher to lower. Um, so, to play it, you start on the high E, um, 14th fret, uh, then you go to the B, 12th fret, then the 10th fret, and then the 12th fret again, and then you play that four times. Okay, then you move up, 15th fret on the high E, 13th fret on the B, 12th fret on the B, 13th fret on the B. Right, and then you play that four times. Okay, and then you move up again, high E, 17th fret, then 15th fret on the B, 13th fret on the B, 15th fret on the B. Four times. Right, then you move up one last time. Uh, 19th fret on the high E, 17th fret on the B, 15th fret on the B, then back to the 17th on the B. And again, play that four times. So all together. Okay. Um, the next exercise is this. Sorry, like this. <laughs> Obviously, like if you're just like starting out, um, play these pieces as slow as you want. That's why I'm not really slowing them down because it's like you can play them whatever speed you're at. Okay. Um, so to play that. Uh, it's all on the high E. Uh, again, you start with an upstroke. Um, eighth fret, fifth fret, seventh fret, eighth fret, seventh fret, fifth fret. And then you play that twice. So that's. Okay, and then it's the same pattern of notes just moved up. That's what this whole exercise is. Right, so then you move up again. Um, so, 10th fret, 7th fret, 8th fret, 10th fret, 8th fret, 7th fret, fret. Play that twice. So. Right, and then move up again. You start on the 12th fret, 8th fret, 10th fret. 12th fret, 10th fret, 8th fret, play that twice, okay, you play all of these patterns twice, so I'll stop saying play it twice, <laughs> um, then move up again, 13th fret, 10th fret, 12th fret, 13th fret, 12th fret, 10th fret, move up again, 15th fret, 12th fret, 13th fret, 15th fret, 13th fret, 12th fret. And then you move up one last time, 17th fret, 13th fret, 15th fret, 17th fret, 15th fret, 13th fret. So all together. And then the next exercise is pretty similar to the first one, except instead of going higher to lower, um, you go lower to higher, right? 
So it's played like this. <laughs> So like I say, lower to higher. You go from the G to the B. Okay, right, so to play it, uh, eighth fret on the G, eleventh uh, fret on the G, not on the G, on the B, ninth fret on the B, eleventh fret on the B. You play that four times. Right, then you move down, seventh fret on the G, 9th fret on the B, 8th fret on the B, 9th fret on the B. You play that four times. And then you move back up to that original pattern and play that four times. It's all together. And then you move up from there, 10th uh, fret on the G, uh, 12th fret on the B, 11th fret on the B, 12th fret on the B. Play that four times, you play all these patterns four times. And then you move up again, um, 11th fret on the G, uh, 14th on the B, 12th on the B, 14th on the B. And then four times. Obviously, if I'm going too fast, just pause the video after like each pattern so you can memorize it. Uh, and then from there, you move back down um, to the pattern before it. And then you move down again. Okay, so all together slowly. And just make sure you follow the tab and you'll be completely fine. Um, and that's it guys, if you have any questions just let me know, hope you enjoy the video um, and thank you for watching. Uh, take care guys, God bless, catch you in a bit, see you later.